Hi, welcome to Adventures in Bonsai. Today I'm going to show you what's been going on with a couple of the plants and also talk to you about ceramic bonsai pots. This is the uh, Buddha belly plant and it developed this nice little flower here. Pretty interesting, eh? Here's the uh, cotton tree and here's some cotton that's popped out. Ready to go and to be made into sweaters. My lemon tree looks like this one is ready to be picked. Now it's soft and it is ready. In fact, I'm going to take it. There it goes. Just kind of fell off. Ooh, that Green looks like it's tree, going to be uh, delicious. Multiple planting is doing okay except for the squirrels. You can see all this stuff on the side. That's all the squirrels dig up. This was covered in moss. It looked quite nice originally and the squirrels are just really tough down here. Now here's a nice little bonsai pot that I really like a lot. Uh, and the tree in it is a, looks like maybe a Japanese, uh, Chinese elm. It's doing pretty nicely. But it is quite an interesting pot. Uh, this one here, I forget what it is exactly, but it's doing pretty good. Growing well. Bamboo nice seeds growth. that sprouted, three of them, but the, the squirrels are just digging this thing up all the time. Cotton bowl that popped out. Pretty neat, huh? Grow your own cotton. It's easy. Okay, well here we are in the shed where the kiln is located, which we got recently. Here's the kiln. Last night we fired it up. It's cooled down. It's about 20 hours later. Uh, you have to wait 20-24 hours for these things to cool off. And now we're going to see if the stuff that I made came out decently or not. Okay. Still warm in here, but not real hot, most certainly. Okay, here's a pot that I made that is warm. It is hot. Oh, I like this a lot. Now, one of these little pieces had fallen off, but I just uh, glazed it, and I'm going to glue it on with super glue. This is hot. i got to put it down. Okay, I need to get my gloves for this because I can tell they're going to be hot inside. Let's These just hold special out heat shield gloves that I have for making rubber stamps, but they should be just fine for here too. Okay, so I got to take out these trays first. Ooh, things are looking interesting. Okay, here's tray number one. And here comes tray number two. Oh boy. Well, I'm liking everything so far. Let's see what we got here. Oh, this one here is stuck to the thing. This one here isn't, though. Okay. Well, that certainly came out interesting. I like that one a lot. Oh boy, this one here is really interesting. These little things that are sticking out are BBs that I put in there. Wow, they make for really interesting decoration here. Uh, pretty wild looking pot. Now we've got to find out what to do about this one here. I've got to take these stilts out. Then I'll take that piece up and see about separating it. Now, these trays that they're on have been coated in a special material that should allow me to get this off. And I see where the the glaze has hit onto here. Well, we'll see what happens here. Uh, stuck pretty good. Got a feeling if I try to really separate, it's going to break and crack. So I'm going to let this thing cool down a little and ask some friends what they would do. But other than that, it was a cute little pot. 
and uh, we'll see if we can separate this thing eventually. So that's the story for today. Have fun with your bonsai and have fun with your pots.